Well, here it is. Now we have our first EDM toll. Um, probably not the best surface finish, but it actually cut real fast. Very easy. Um, I ended up feeding it by hand, just turning this. Uh, but yeah, a couple things I had to change up. I used a brass electrode. Let me show you. This is the electrode I used. Uh, brass worked uh, much, much better. But uh, also I wasn't turning it. Just so you guys know, that was uh, just stationary plunging down. Also, you see uh, capacitors are gone. I had to take out the dual capacitors on the electrode side. This is the filtered side. This is just filtering the, the DC coming in. After the lamp, you put a capacitor. Um... I forget the size of it. Probably like 150 microfarad. Um, and it made all the difference in the world uh, as far as the arc goes. So between switching to brass and uh, changing that capacitor, it made a ton of difference. So we're, uh, we're making some good progress here. Now... Uh, I think the next thing we're going to do, uh, fellow YouTuber John Strange, he uh, suggested trying to burn out a tap, a broken tap. And at work, I get those all the time, and that's a really good idea. I'm going to do that. Uh, next time I get a broken tap at work, we're going to try to burn it out and see how it does. Uh, I'm very interested to see what we can accomplish with this. Now, the next stage of this endeavor is going to be getting this CNC running um, tight. In other words, I gotta get all the dimensions perfect. You know, if I say two inches, it moves two inches. And also, I need to figure out how much this needs to feed down uh, and at what rate when I'm doing this EDM and I know it's going to change because doing it in aluminum I almost couldn't keep up I mean I was literally trying to spin this using my thumbs as fast as I could uh, it, it just plunged right through like butter but I'm I, I know it's not going to do the same thing for uh, carbide or you know high speed steel I know it's going to change up a little bit so uh, it's going to be a little trial and error and again, I don't want to do this just to make holes. That's, that's not my purpose. My purpose is I want to be able to take a brass electrode and I want to see and see out a gear or a profile uh, using the EDM method. That's what I'm striving for. But uh, all right, guys. Have a good night.